Okay. Before I start, I'm going to see if there's any tips on this fucking tormentor. Okay, so he's got two glowing weak points on each shoulder. And destroying them exposes a weak point on the Tormentor's chest. That's when they become much more aggressive. They use Void. Keep your distance, use cover, immobilize them with strand. Slow at first. They won't be very agile, so jump, bob, and weave after exposing their their uh, chest weak point. Telegraph their attacks, usually with big swing. Yeah, I know. Suppressing scythe attacks from tormentors, cancel your super and yep. Finishers. So, I mean, I can slap on some more void defense so they don't hit as hard. It's not going to be a end all be all, it's still going to be a very difficult fight. <coughs> so, just leveling up my gear is going to go a long way. So maybe we start there, run a couple uh, run a couple more events. Oh my goodness, Lucy. Uh, sir? It's not my cat's yelling at us. Do 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 Excuse me. Checking, checking, okay, let's see what they have. Ingram or a kanji, sixty four, I think that said. Just go get loving, Lucy. Jump up on the bed. Why? What? You're so talkative. Yes, hello. I love you too. Uh huh. Okay. That sounds fascinating. Yeah, we can immediately break that down. We've got three of these, that's what I was, they were all 1766, so Explosive Head, Incandescent, and Archer's Tempo are the three to look at and understand, so yeah, they all have perfect float, I believe, no, maybe not, um, being in combat for a moderate time increases airborne effectiveness and reduces flinch until you are out of combat and arrows explode after a short delay. That's kind of self-explanatory. So that's perfect float, and then incandescence. Defeating a target spreads Scorch to those nearby. More powerful combatants and opposing guardians cause Scorch in a larger radius. That's probably the one I want to go for. And then Archer's Tempo. Draw time decreases after every precision hits going to be hard to actually utilize to its fullest, so let's go ahead and stick with this. We'll lock it. 
so it doesn't get lost in the shuffle here. And that's the idea. See? Trade of places with that. Okay. And then what else does it have, just out of curiosity? It's got Stunning Recovery, Vanguard's Vindiction, or Wild Card. Final blows of this weapon have a chance to create experimental sub-munitions at the target's location. Cool. Stunning a champion partially refills your magazine, triggers health regeneration, and improves recovery for a short duration. That's really good. And final blows of this weapon grant a small amount of health. This seems to do everything. So we've got helical fletching and straight fletching. Increases accuracy or accuracy and stability. Seems like it's already on the right one. Tactile string or high tension string. This will bring up my accuracy, but reduce my draw time and decrease stability. I think I want to leave it with this. I'm pretty sure these draw times are pretty high. Um, that is not special ammunition, so we don't really want to use that for PvE as it's going to double up my primaries. The only... The only way around that is using Irakanji right now in combination with it. So I think we want to stick on my grenade launcher. So we've got a primary, second, special, and heavy. This is the one I want to go with for the Nightfalls. Why are there chests up here? Can I? No, oh, I can't. Dude. Well, son of a bitch. Lots of hullabaloos here. Like, lots. And then that one's still not. So it seems like this is cumulative. Like, everybody's helping the progress of that. And the title, probably sent to Postmaster as well. Checking no, that one wasn't. Underway. Okay. I mean, yeah, they're all pretty low level, so I really get to choose which one I want here. <laughs> Should probably take this opportunity. Oh, there's two. There's two that have that gold. Hi again, <clears throat> I probably want to keep one of those. Please, Guardian. It's busy. So, Vorpal. Damage against bosses, vehicles, and guardians with their super active. Classy Contender. Final blows of this weapon grant class ability energy. This is a grenade jail. launcher. And then these... Ah, okay, so it's already masterworked. It dropped masterwork. So that's a condition that I can impart on any of these. So I'm really just looking for the right distribution of mods here. So, let's see. The one that I have now is Vorpal. It doesn't have the additional weapon perk. I wonder if that's imparted with the masterwork quality? Possibly. Oh, wow. And this one... Wow. This one, you can switch out all four of these. One for all, hitting three separate targets, increases damage for a moderate duration, or Golden Tricorn. We've seen this one before. Uh, final blows, grant bonus damage while the buff is active. Grenade or melee kills of the same damage type greatly increase. Okay, Classy Contender. I think they all may get Classy Contender. Yes, yes, yeah. Okay, so that's a weapon related, and then compressed waveframe obviously is. So we've got a few different things to choose from here, but this is definitely the top pick so far. This is at Masterwork, and I can't trade off the fourth here. 
but picking it would stick me with One for All and Golden Tricorn, and Enlightened Action and Envious Assassin. Defeating targets with other weapons before drawing this one transfers ammo to the magazine from reserves. This effect can overflow the magazine based on the number of targets defeated, and dealing damage improves reload speed and handling. Implosion rounds. I mean... I just don't know enough about when I'm going to be using this to really decide what I want. I'm thinking Hullabaloo may be a good gun for I PvP. Let, let's see. Let's see. Let's let's turn to Google here. Please, Guardian. It's busy. Yeah, Hullabaloo God Roll. So this is what everybody is looking for. Considering that grenade launchers aren't the top choice for Crucible, this hullabaloo god roll focuses on PvE effectiveness. Okay, that helps already, right off the bat. Barrel, we're looking for quick launch. We do not have that on this. Confined launch, smart drift control. Magazine, we're looking for high velocity rounds. We have that. Trait 1, Envious Assassin, and Volt Shot. Well, we have Envious Assassin, but not Volt Shot. Trait 2, Chain Reaction, and Vorpal Weapon. We have neither. Masterwork, Reload Speed. Hi again. That is not what this Masterwork is. And Classy Contender is already, Maybe. yeah, Origin Trait. <clears throat> okay, so now we know what we're looking for, or at least what one person is looking for. There's quick launch, high velocity, those are not the ones, but it does have Vorpal, and that's handling, not reload speed. So moving on to the next, we've got high velocity, not quick launch, not Vorpal, and not reload speed. Wait, did I already say that? You know what I mean. This one has Volt Shot, and Vorpal, and High Velocity, and Quick Launch, but not Reload Speed. But so far, this is the closest to God Roll that we've had. Envious, Vorpal, that's another good one, High Velocity, no Quick Launch, there's Reload Speed. So I may want to keep these two, and drop these. But as opposed to dropping them, I can use them to level up my other gear. So, I like the Marcado. It's a good weapon. Let's use the 69 to bring that up. Since they're masterwork, I really could be breaking these down for a good deal of... That may be a better use for these lower, this lower one. Yeah, that gives me 7 en enhancement cores. That's, that's good. Uh, 64, that could definitely help out with this guy right here. Guardian. Okay, let's go grab some of the others. Welcome back. I can probably see what their loadout is in here, yep. Impulse amplifier, chain reaction. Chain reaction was something that... Here we go. And collective, volt shots, high velocity, ball to launch handling, eh. High velocity, reload speed. It's just not quite there in, in the rest. Grave robber, vorpal, reload. Or high velocity, rather. And reload. Okay, so there's another reload speed. And this is absolutely nothing that we need except for these first two. So let's uh, dismantle this. Dismantle these. 64 and 60. Actually, we may be able to use those. 
Thank you. Thank you. Do I have enough room Checking. to grab them? Acknowledged. No. It's busy. Okay, so we really want to keep ones with reload speed. And if it doesn't have it, we'll break down the ones with... Yeah, because that gives me a shit ton of cores. So that didn't. That just had a really good roll on Vort shot, Volt Shot and Vorpal. But this has two that are recommended as well. So 64, 66, 65... We could also use bringing this. I don't know if I want to keep this, though. I know I want to keep these two. My machine guns. It would be nice to have a, a rocket launcher on hand. Do that. And I can do one more. This is already a sword at 68. I don't know how great this roll is. I don't really think now's the time in the game where I have to worry about that too much, though. Crap, that was one that I wanted to keep, wasn't it? No, this was. This was the one with reload speed. Yep. <clears throat> okay, so let's lock that. Lock these. I don't know about those yet. Let's grab this extra. Break that down. Please, Guardian. It's busy. And then this is where the other one is trying to go. Traxapos? Tra Traxapos? I'm not sure. That's a scout rifle. I don't have any copies. Probably not going to use a submachine gun up here. So let's get rid of this for now. It's also a pretty low low power stat, so is the scout rifle Nameless Midnight. I have other scout rifles that can be checking, used. Checking, checking. And that's another track, suppose. And it's a masterwork. So, I feel like I'm... Since scout rifle is one of my favorites, we can oh, work this out right on my own. Maybe not, because I'm over here thinking that range is probably going to be a good thing for a scout rifle, and I'm, I'm probably dead wrong. That that might just be, like, a useless fucking ability. Oh. Light.gg is a really cool website. Okay, so... So curated, okay, not all curated roles actually drop in game. Eververse isn't just a title, it's a promise. I never thought I'd live to see the darkness hmm. return. Anything for you? Okay, this is showing me what's good for theory crafters like this perk for PvP and PvE. And then obviously that's PvE, and this is PvP. Okay, cool. Popular trait combos. Popular individual perks, masterwork popularity, mod popularity. So people like reload speed, handling, stability, and range. It's literally split in quarters here. Counterbalance stock is one of the favorites for this. Reduces recoil deviation for the weapon. That's uh, in the lead by 3%, so we're going to equip it with that. Range seems to be okay for a masterwork roll. Definitely not the only choice, but uh, they don't like this one. They do not like this one. Um, but they like 
this one about the same, a little bit less. Okay, next. And it's this, Accurized Rounds, overwhelmingly. Next up, we've got, this isn't even on the list, I don't see. Hi again, Guardian. Yeah, single bullet, Eye of the Storm. As your health gets lower, no. Please Zen you. moment, people seem to like. And hatchling is a pretty high one. And then as far as the origin, people are overwhelmingly going classy contender. Okay, so this seems to be a decent roll of this weapon. Let's trash the other. We won't be needing it. 64. I can bring something else up with that. Monte Carlo's only at 63, but that doesn't seem to really be worth it. I can bring Soros Regime up too. She said she wanted to express herself. Let's bring Soros Regime up too. Even though I'm pretty sure this is a crap roll for this weapon. That's just what I'm going to assume for all of them. Actually, I only have one upgrade module left. Let's just dismantle this. I don't think that's really worth using that on. Okay, we've got a bunch of the title. That's the next one. We're going to get through these. We're going to do it. The title, Submachine Gun Season 23, I guess is what we're at. I've seen a 32, but... isn't just a title. It's a promise. Okay, so this is a legendary energy submachine gun. It is currently ranked number one in submachine guns, it looks like. Am I reading that right? I'm not sure if I'm reading that right. The curated... Let's just check this one first. It's going to be this with the two little arrows. I don't have it on this one. Two bullets crossed. I don't have it on this one. First of all, let's just check out what this masterwork is locked to. People like... So, masterwork popularity. Uh, again, it's pretty split. Based on 278,000 copies, these are the most frequently equipped masterworks. Of those, blah blah blah, were fully masterworked. But it doesn't show what people's opinion of it is. Let me see if I can find that. I don't know what this curated is. Eververse isn't just a title. It's a promise. Popular ranks only apply to random roles. Please, Guardian. It's busy. I think curated is just creating a generally good role of it for you. So, what are the... Yeah, it's really saying any of them. Uh, it's a submachine gun, so stability would definitely work. Little recoil, that seems like it would be one of the best. It doesn't appear in here as... Random rolls. What does that look like? It's a bullet standing on end with like two little... Yeah, I don't see that in this list, so... Let's just look at these for now and assume that this is going to work just fine for us. Um, popular trait combos. Repulsor brace and destabilizing rounds. See, it's saying that 11.74% of rolls use that. I don't know if that's just stating that that's the most likely to occur, or that's what people prefer. But one thing's for sure, this list here is what people prefer. Aggressive frame is intrinsic, okay. They like the little crosshair with the up, small bore. And that's for both PvE and PvP. 
between these two, it looks like the only one ranked is none. So I did not roll into the secondary that people like. Dynamic Sway is good for PvP. So let's just immediately move this over to PvP. This is good for PvP as well. And then... These are the most frequently equipped perks. Let's learn more. What the best role is on each weapon. By sourcing the Global Destiny population using the Bungie API, API, we are able to see which perks a wide variety of players select for each weapon. Those stats are presented as a community average role. Okay, so I should be looking at this, this heat map. And with that, 15.4% show this. We're only 117 show that. Uh, this is actually quite high, 17%. 14.4, and it looks like everybody is going with Classy Contender, but that may just be because that's what, the, what it defaults to. And finally, what do people... Backup mag is what people are putting. Increases magazine size. That makes a lot of sense. So let's lock that. That is now a PvP ready gun. It's already master worked at 1764. Let's see if any of these score a little bit higher. I wonder if I can plug something in on this website and it kind of show me what my ranking is. That's, that might not be a good way to do this. So this is reload speed. That would be really helpful as well. I don't have the best one for this. Nor do I have the best one. So this, this looks like a wash right here. We're going to go ahead and get rid of that one. I think that was this. Yeah. That was that. Let's check this. This one also looks like a wash with stability, which is what we have on the other. Let's get rid of that. Could I be using these to level anything up? 64? Yeah, definitely but not anything I really use, to be honest. And this one. Again. I mean, this is a good one. People like Repulsor Brace. Defeating a Void debuff target grants an overshield. And that is range. Arguably not one of the best, I'm assuming. And again, my uh, upgrade material is running low, so we're not going to waste it on that. Okay. So I think we've compiled some pretty decent guns. I think I have one more Check thing with her. No, I do not. Alright, that's that. I know. I know. That was painful. It was probably, probably painful to watch. Let's see what we've got. I think I did a decent job, though. We're going to start putting a little more effort. Okay. And I don't have copies of this, so we're just going to keep it around for now. Uh, it is better than nothing, so... And I have room to store it. You're a big dude. Gunsmith. Sure. I need bounties. Hey, there's two more of those. And a few more guns that I don't know what to do with. Awesome. What do I pick up here? A pizzicato. You know, for now, I may just throw all the stuff I'm not using into the vault here. 
Just in case I need it later. Fucking pulse rifles. Yeah, I, I don't know that I would use these anytime soon. I'll keep the sniper rifle. Keep a pulse rifle. Keep my scout rifle. Keep my sidearm. So we've got two auto rifles here. And a hand cannon. Yeah, probably not going to use that. Keep the title on us. Combat bow. Yeah, that looks fine. Keep that. Grenade launcher. We have a ton of grenade launchers. Let's go ahead and use the grenade launcher we just outfitted. Two machine guns. I'll keep those for their different uh, energies. 1763. That can just be dismantled, I believe. And that's my one that's all built up. But now that this one's built up even higher... Oh, that's the Send and Protector. I don't want to get rid of that. And yeah, we'll just dismantle that. That's fine. By the time I get the energy to... Uh, the materials to use that as an upgrade, I'll probably have a better one I can't than just one point in upgrade. The crucible be more like you? This was made for you. Okay. Get Be all my bounties. Talk to me, Rumor has it all held at home. Let's see if anybody else wants to talk to me. I don't believe they do. So, now the question is, do we go cruise? Well, I only have one more to complete here before I get a pentacle gear, I believe. Uh, lots of recreational playlists. Go ahead and complete these. And that should have allowed me to do something. Let's see what. I have ideas already. Okay, so I could take one of these uh, mid-range. Well, I definitely need pulse rifles, fusion rifles, or hand cannons. No, maybe I don't use these. Earn precision spree vanguard medals during Guardian Games playlist. I might be able to do that. I could get you And it looks like I could take both, so it didn't matter. Uh, let's get another Trials Platinum card, as opposed to Crucible or Gambit. I wish I could and then I turn something in with him. I don't believe it pumped me up a level, but let's check anyways. Let's begin. Uh, he's green. I think that means new. Yeah. Okay. Now. Do we want to make any changes? That's probably a better idea for... Let's, uh... One or more saved items cannot be found. Okay, that's fine, because... I just... Hey, and it just stays there. Perfect. So now that's completely done. Let's overwrite. Perfect. Go back to PvE for now. Claws, yep. All looks good. Stat increases all the way up the board. Okay. And quest is still going off because of those. Okay, got it. So, what they want me to do, complete any of the following objectives to earn the skimmer. Oh, right, yeah. Medallion score, top 10% score in Nightfall Challenges, open your focus activity, winner's packages. I don't know where those are. And I can't uh, get any more details on them. I wish I could get more, but I am working now. It's just wonderful. Open your focus I activity winners packages. No fucking idea. Hmm. Okay. Oh, for nineteen hundred of a currency that I don't have. Cool. Great deal. Yep, no idea. 
but I can't deposit more medals. Hey, look at that. Got emblems. Got more stuff. It's just never ending shit. Parabellum. I'll figure that out later. Got another hullabaloo. Not what I'm looking for. I never thought I'd live to see the darkness uh, return. Prodigal gloves. Can use those to bring up of, of Ophidian aspects. Let's do that real quick. Seems to be a solid, solid play. To, yeah, it did just do that. Okay. All right. And then um, let's do a PVE first, and then we'll jump into Guardian, supremacy. Please come in, come in. So hop into here. Class matchmaking. These should go pretty quickly. Get three thousand, thirty thousand, something. Increase Vanguard rank. Arc threats. Strand surge. And solar surge. Perfect. Certain foes are stealthy when out of distance. They become visible when near a guardian. So we want to use strand whenever possible, which means we're going to switch over to Mercado. And I've already got solar. Lots of solar. I can also use a strand scout rifle, but that breaks my class. That's going to be solar. That's not harsh language. The title is void. We just picked up Parabellum, which is solar. But we want a special. I do also want to use my bow. So we're going to use my bow. These aren't Nightfall. I should be able to get to them pretty easily. And while we're in here, let's figure this out.
Back there. The path is unblocked. Oh, wow. I gotcha, I gotcha. There's your ride. You just hop on and I'll handle the rest. Why did we stop? Finch, we're stuck again. Oh, seriously, but I did the thing. It's just this hive tech. It's so archaic. Uh, it's just, just give me a sec. This is a temple to Oryx? Yeah, that's right. Zavathun's brother. The Taken King himself. These two killed each other about a million times over, but she dedicated a temple to him. It's funny how that works. Now be careful here. Something happened to this place. It's overgrown with darkness. 
I can sense light here, though. I just can't see it. Maybe there's a safe path through. stating I hate this place. Looks like we're all clear, Finch. We're heading in. Oh, oh, careful. Away. The knight guarding this place? He's an old rival of Oryx, and he's no joke. Pretty funny that Sabathun has him guarding Oryx's temple, though. That was dumb, and I never want to have to do it again.
Nice. Lucy, what are you doing? What are you doing, buddy? of it. Yes, I see you. Yes, you're a very cute kitty. You're, it's not time to eat yet. It's not time because you haven't gone to feed him yet. Oh my goodness, was that a, was that a jump? Did you do a jump hug? Uh-huh. Okay. Hello. I see you, yes. Damn, got 30 fucking Vanguard medals. Alright, so still Strand, still Solar. Yes, we all hear you. That's enough, buddy. Running seasonal playlists. shrouded in darkness through the nearby caverns. There you'll find the means to breathe life into the parasite once again. Understood. We'll contact you when we reach oh. it. I gotcha. Or not. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I did the same thing.
Okay, now that that's taken care of.
this scorn tech lying around makes me think they're using the darkness energy in this place to build some sort of lair. Best we clean them out. That was way too high. the throne world. I'll attempt to locate them. Looks like our cryptoglyphs drain too. But we may be able to fix that. See that you do. Keep the parasite safe. I'll be in contact once I locate our next incubator. You're welcome. received limited intel regarding a Vex information depot. I want you to get in there and figure out what they know.
hung up on rocks. I'm making the elimination of Kargan your priority of this operation.
There's Cargan. Location secured, Commander Zavala. Good work, Gun. What intel did you discover? Hmm. There's only one data artifact here, labeled OXA, and it's seriously corrupted. Metadata says it was last accessed by an Otzot centuries ago. What is OXA? And who is Otzot? Those are questions for another day, I suppose. But for now, well done. Love the saucer. That shit's awesome. The Lucent Hive are targeting guardians in this sector. Track down our missing fire teams and target any hive leadership you encounter. Once you locate a hive lieutenant, my scions will help you sever its connection to the Lucent Brood.
The Lucent Hive drained the light from our guardians. It's horrible. Stop them before they do something worse. Scion sends portal energies not commonly used by the Hive. This could be why they were harvesting light. Take up the Hive relics and rend their shields.
seventh woman damn bones. However, she doesn't the synaptic spear will Got drive me. her out. Hello, my cat's outside. Guardian, we've picked up a high-gain transmission. Origin point is somewhere along the coast, near the Cosmodrome. Yeah, 
That's Rasputin, the AI Warmind. If I'm understanding him correctly, it's a distress call. There are so few ballet fans left, Guardian. It'd be a shame to lose him. the threat and aid rescue a threat to the war mind is a threat to the city as well Just a little longer. I think Rasputin is testing me. I could try to override Rasputin's system locks, but no telling how he might react. 
Must be some other way to bypass his systems. It worked. Maybe too well. of Rasputin's power grid. It's similar to what we use to power the city, but its drift velocity is totally different than ours. Fascinating. As a fellow inorganic life form, I just want to note that Rasputin has a much better setup than I do. He has a secret bunker with space weapons. I live in your backpack.
Marshal. Thank you from the old man. Typical. The Fallen will claim nothing from this breach. Not even the debris. I'm sending a fire team to seal the complex. I got a Darcy this catalyst. This cannot happen again. It will not. Thanks to you, Guardian, the dream of the city lives good, uh, good on. Good final word for my last uh, playlist. Cool. Thank you guys, it's been a pleasure. Nice. So I can reset my Vanguard rank now. It's pretty cool. Let's go do that. I've gotten all my points for uh, my Guardian games for that specific playlist. Next up is Crucible, and I haven't done Gambit for a while, but I don't think a reward has been on weekly rotation. I'll have to check. I don't think it's the same week that I played those Gambit matches. It may just not have had a uh, weekly reward. I know. I don't. I don't know. Okay. There's definitely some stuff that I missed and/or could not fit in my stash. Hi there. Let's see what it was. Yeah. Hands back Cool. Okay. Step on up. Take a look. See if I got. Oh my god. Before I do any of that, let's check. Yeah, here we go. Quests. Turn these in. Wish class masterwork boost. Nice. That's not the one I got. Cool. Okay. Those are done. Season of the Wish. Got that. I think that's everything here. Journey. Triumphs. Indestructible. Guardian Games playlist without dying. Can't believe I hadn't done that yet. Scorn anywhere in the system. Done. And a couple of Witch Queen. Fallen Saber Strike done. I still have to do Nightfall Fallen Saber. Cause of Metals. Rivals 3 Emblem. Nice. Really glad I got that tip. Otherwise, Your I wouldn't have been getting any of this shit. Okay. Decryption can break Still your waiting on sun bracers. What? Okay, she has something. Something she wants to say. What's up? Let's see, let's see. Masterclass Parabellum. Uh, so I can now acquire this. All Star I think I already have that. Yeah, I definitely do. It's weird that it allows me to grab it again. I'm guessing we're going to, uh. Got it. To reset on this, right? Very good. Ascendant shard, additional rank rewards. Oh, okay, I have to hold it. 
there's one prestige. Okay, and now I'm back to rank one of 17. I don't think that's gonna limit what I can do, but I'm probably wrong. That's okay. I'm used to being wrong. Oh my goodness, Lucy. This dude's just checking large piles of gold here. Uh, I don't think I have anything else in here that I need to do. Vendor rank ups. I do need to accomplish that. Gunsmith Bounty still needs three. I've already done his. I need to do Gambit, all eight, and that'll give me some bright dust. And then I also need to do all seven trials. I haven't done any trials. Oh, that's what I keep accepting as trials. And that's why I'm never going to, uh, to get any of those, because I'm not doing them. Yeah, I should definitely hop into Trials of Osiris. I've never played them before. Scalar potential masterwork bonus. Okay. He's a danger only to himself. Uh, what do I have in here? Ah. Nice. Very nice. Anthemic invocation shell. And this goes all the way up to 100. Yep. Dying dream at the end. I really need to get up there. Got a lair key next. Season rank up, 51. Perfect. Okay, is that everything? Probably. So let's sort through this. Ooh, I'm up into the 73. So those are pretty nice. I, I can always just re-roll stuff. I'm going to be using one of these two and then sun bracers. I don't really think I have to worry about keeping other ones around for now. Oh, I have no upgrade modules. Okay. Understood. So let's see. Chivalric fire. This is a sword. Oof. See what it gets. Wow. This is weird. Rapidly defeating targets with this weapon grants bonus sprint speed. Guardians powerful Guardians, powerful combatants, and high value targets grant this bonus quicker. Of course, Vanguard's vindi Vindication, health. Increased reload speed and handling when out of combat. Is this a gun? Caster frame. Launch a heavy projectile attack. Heavy attacks are stronger with full energy. Okay, this is definitely a unique weapon here. And it's at Masterwork with Impact. I don't know what the fuck Impact... I'm guessing damage? Yeah. Well, that would probably be the favorite, wouldn't it? Okay, that's up to 71. That's my Ascendant Protector. Sixty-five can go in the trash. All data has a lineage. And then no how ancient or corrupted. Sixty-five can go in the trash. And then we'll keep these around to level these up. Got another one of these, but not with what I'm looking for on here. But it is a sixty-six, so let's just cannibalize itself. Oh, I had an upgrade module and it just used it on that. I was looking for a... whatever. I guess I picked it up somewhere. It's a 70 Parabellum. I'm not sure what stats I'm looking for on those yet, so I'm just going to keep that around. 68, 65... probably... keep that around as well. Oh, classic contender field prep. Get rid of this. Yeah. We should forget about fighting them on the yeah. ground. Yeah. Sure. Supply lines. All data has a lineage, no matter how ancient or corrupted. It is always been banned. Cool. 
crucible ornament from the chivalric fire sword, Phoenix Flame. Okay, so chivalric fire is a thing. Like, okay, good to know. We're gonna try to complete as much of the season before it ends as possible. See if I have anything in my inventory after this to... Okay, so we have 56 enhancement cores now. That's good to know. Deep Slate Harmonizer. Okay, I remember that. Exotic Cipher from Xur. Monumental Lost Lights. And oh! Five of these at a time. Did I always have that? I have six Gambit Engrams, nine Wish Engrams. Nice. And I've gotten more lair keys. Lair chests can be found after clearing pathways in Riven's lair or the coil. Gambit Memento. Right, okay. And seven enhancement prisms. Three ascendant shards. Blind well. I still haven't been there. I'll have to figure out what that does in time. Okay, so. Um, let's overwrite this. I don't know if I've made any huge changes, but... Yeah, weapons. Let's select this. And, okay, so I... Oh, right, I got that. Uh, so I've got recurrent impact machine gun. I think I want... Oh, grenade launchers aren't very popular in... Right. Probably want a sword. So let's just try that. Why not, right? Didn't I set this to PvP? Oops. No. I set the title to PvP. That should be set to PvP, because that's the only time I use Suros Regime. Even though I don't know if that's the best one to use. This has much more impact. 200 rounds per minute versus 600. Is it a full auto? Move faster with this weapon equipped. 10 range. I mean, you know what? Let's try it. I now have no exotics. Which is a little bit of an issue. But I think I may still be able to, to do a decent job. Uh, I don't know. Let's keep this for now. Let's keep that for now. And that really just changed out my sword. And then let's stick something on my sword. So let's bring this up, see what the god roll of chivalric fire is. Let's lock this in a moment. Did I spell that wrong, really? No. Okay, so, yep, impact is the only thing it drops with. It looks like this may be pretty, pretty standardized. Yeah, it is. So what do people have equipped on this? 
was it? It's actually not going to tell me. It's not going to tell me. Okay, so let's see what our options are here. So I can choose between R1, landing three light attack hits within a short time, branch sword ammo. Okay. Got it. Defeating a void debuff target, so repulsor brace. Got it. Uh, dealing sustained damage creates an orb of power. Final blows cause nearby targets to become volatile. I don't know which would be better for PvP. Are we volatile? I want to say volatile. Uh, that's... I'm not sure. Yeah, I want to say volatile. Uh, final blows of this weapon grant a small amount of health. Increased reload speed and handling when out of combat. And gun and run. I want to say gun and run is probably going to be the way to go. Against powerful enemies, bosses, and vehicles. I don't know what guardians are considered. Increases magazines. Pretty useless, I think. Ready speed and aim down sight range at which radar detects enemies, or weapons ready and stow speed. Let's just do radar booster, because I don't know if any of these damage increases actually work on guardians. I don't know if that's a bad move or not. Oh, okay. That's not what I meant to do. Overwrite this. There we go. Oh, and... And... We've got a Darcy... Uh, do I want to put it in this one? I don't know if this role of Darcy is actually any good. I haven't looked at it yet. Where is she? Right there. Is this set? Oh, this is season one. I don't want season one. Or is it? Is there only one? Yeah, it looks like there's only one. Okay, so so it looks like this is set. This only rolls as one, so I don't really need to worry about god rolls on exotics like this, I don't believe. Let's go ahead and put the catalyst in. So it's now a masterwork. And I can upgrade masterwork. Defeat enemies with precision hits using Darcy to unlock this upgrade. Got it. Increases stability when I do. Cool. So that's done. I had picked up one more Skyburner's Oath. I think I have... Yep, I do. So, I really should be using this. I don't know if this would be decent for P. 
PvP or not. Okay, anyways, enough dicking around. Let us hop into another supremacy. We need one more. Let's try out some of this shit. Two winter skiles here. So it does look like they have different now, not on weapons, just on armor. Break this down. Ow. Right back. Oh shit, I was worried that we would start while I was in the bathroom, and instead we've lost two players. That looks pretty cool. Still doesn't look as cool as mine though. There we go. You just gotta distract yourself. That speeds along. 362 commendations. Deep Sight Resonance Extractions on this weapon will unlock its pattern. Earning victory in the Crucible, 30th anniversary, any data port in a storm quest, I guess. Found in strikes, gambits, and... Oh, those are just catalysts.
Slay your opponents. Take their crest. Flapjack's just being a dick. That shut them down.
Five minutes remaining. Three minutes. Double down. One minute. The enemy's almost won. for us all. Don't let this discourage you. Fight hard and glory will be yours again.
Oh, I'm glad that was the only supremacy I had to play for that, because I'm not too excited about getting back in there. Fucking crazy. Okay, so there's a thing behind... Yeah. I don't know what that is. Nightfall weapon? Is that what that's showing me? Out here, I've got these two indicators. Well, unclaimed challenges, okay. Maybe that's... Yeah, drop in all-star vector. I, I'm, hmm. Hmm. Curious. are just not doing well. Yeah, so I think it's just telling me that I can do this. Like, eventually. There's a lot we can do. Thanks. That's very helpful. Do come back soon, Daddy. Postmaster hash rep for me. And I got another the title. Sixty-eight. physical expression. Bring this one up. Because I don't think that that's better. Yeah. Oh, I guess if it's the same gun, I don't need. I don't know if that's if that's actually the case. And there's a 70. 70. Blah. Class Contender Rangefinder Threat Detector. Pretty much what I have now, except for that dynamic sway reduction. I don't know if Threat Detector was ranked higher. Enemies are in close proximity. Submachine gun, that may happen. Let's let's bring up the title one more time. This is range. I want to say mine has range. No, stability. I think stability is going to be better, so maybe I just use this as an upgrade. I don't know. I may regret this later, but yeah, this just takes glimmer. Oh. These all take an upgrade module, but I guess if it's the same gun, it just takes glimmer. That's cool.
Okay, good to know. We wanted to bring... Actually, this is probably more important to bring out. And I don't have any more. 1774, wow, that's... And it would actually be better resilience, but I don't really need the extra resilience. I'm already at cap on my... First of all, let's overwrite this, even though I don't she think said I've done she anything. Wanted to express herself, so yeah, I'm already at cap on this. Up. Actually, I don't know how that is better resilience. Ten. Try again. Yeah, that's 26. I don't know what I was just looking at. Ready and waiting. Strange. Well, not going to worry about it. I don't have anything to upgrade this with. Yeah, no upgrade modules. These can just be dismantled. That just kind of looks cool. I can always get it back though. Okay, and that should be it. I'm back on my... Let's just overwrite this, just to be sure nothing changed. It didn't. Nothing on that. Nothing in there. And I now have 60. I can get six more... It's a Enhancement prisms, but I'm gonna hold off. Let's go look at this exotic cipher real quick, and then we'll figure out the mystery that I is these two the map icons. Is there anything below here? Oh, there is. I'm not going to make that. I died. I did the death. Whoa. Why, why would you do that? Oh, it's these fans. Huh. Would you look at that? But I want to be on that thing. These fucking stairs. Awesome. Anything? Oh, there's there's stairs over here. Aw, but there's stairs over there. Aw. It's just nothing, huh? I 
guess not. She, she wanted to express herself, so I gave her a thumbs up. You were watching NBC. I want to go over there. I think I've checked all of this stuff. I've definitely checked everything over here. But not... Can I get in here? No. Not on the way here. Oh, wait. Is there going to be a way for me to get to those, those catwalks? Oh, these fans don't blow. Hmm. Oh, there's a dude just over there welding. Oh, there's got to be something here, right? Yeah. Yeah. That's that's all the stuff. Oh, have I already gotten that? I must have. Shit. So let's see. What are those? Did that just give me a new lore? No, it did not. So what the actual fuck? There's nothing in collections that that unlocked. Really? That's not... what? Oh! Top ten, that's, it's reversed from what I'm thinking. Yeah, that makes more sense. Oh, I've got super efficiency. Oh, I understand. All of this shit's very misleading. So I've got to get all of these stat trackers up. Trials of Osiris is zero on everything. So is raids, because I've never done a raid. <coughs> so is destinations, somehow. Flawless completes. Oh, wait, no. I've got Lost Sectors and Heroic Public Events. Okay, well. Yeah, I think I've run out of stuff to look at. Still gotta do all this shit. Seasonal journey, nightfall, complete nightfalls, all using a subclass that matches the current surge. Well, I've been using solar. Armor charge mods unlocked. Really, just for this? Well shit, maybe I need to do another nightfall. I was about to say, I can't believe I haven't done any of these, but two in there. Oh, there's still a lot. But apparently that lasts for another 79 days, so I've got more than enough time to do that one. Yeah, I think I'm gonna... I can track objectives. Oh yeah, I can. I don't want to do that though. Okay, yeah, I think I'm going to call it there. Don't think there's anything else. Oh, right, drop in. I want to check this real quick. Open your focus activity winners packages. Leave that tab up. Light 
GG, that's pretty cool. Open your focus active, there we go. Okay, so... You get them... What you actually need to acquire and open are the Focus Champions packages you get when your class triumphs in a Focus activity. Well, that's not gonna happen. Warlocks have been, uh, pretty low, so I can also get my medallion score up. Which I'm not sure how to check. And I still want to know what that symbol is. There's a legend, right? Yeah, but not one that helps me. Focused activity begins in three days. No, three hours. Definitely not what I'm looking for. Hmm. Looks like a ship. It can't be the Nightfall weapon. It's behind this symbol. It's like out in the middle. Let's just look for Tower. Destiny 2 map symbols Tower. So this one doesn't show it. And that's only flashing because I added a waypoint. Oh, I need to go talk to this guy, apparently. All three of these guys. Why? What do you, uh, what do you want? I think I'm gonna have to figure that simple thing out offline. Just poke around Google a bit until I find the answer. Guardian. Yeah, what do you what do you want? Oh. Take it. Got it. Keep focus. And then apparently other
other people have stuff for me too. Run down to Gambit. Is there a faster way to get to Gambit if I go this way? That's no. here. Check that. Carry on. But it says you are. Oh, because you're under a level. Okay. This area is very confusing. I'm just gonna have to familiarize myself with it a little bit more. So, that would be down this way. I know you're one of these. I just can't remember which level. Is it this? No, that's what I tried before. So, go down. There we go. No, that's the same place I went before. So it must be... Ah. There we go. Okay. How you living? Confused, mostly. Don't break that, alright? What? A bounty? How am I going to break a bounty? You're not helping my confusion any, dude. I haven't looked at all down here for thingies. But I don't really feel like it right now. So I'm not going to. Why do you still want to talk to me? Did I not just grab everything that you had to offer? What's up, hero? Rank seven. Next major rank. Next rank. I don't I don't know what you want from me. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna deal with all that later. I'm gonna hop off. 
Have a good one. I will see you tomorrow.